Clayton Bailey here, Green Scene Home Inspections, at a newer construction house, and I see that this happens quite a lot, and I always want to explain it to people. So the builder was awesome enough to put a grounding system into a house, um, but then your utility provider is not utilizing it. So I just want to point this out so that you guys know builders are awesome, and they put these ground uh, grounds in there. So that if, uh, lightning strikes or indirect lightning strikes, you don't lose your modem, your cable, your internet, and all that kind of fun stuff. So I'm going to flip this around. Um, you can see that this is our bonding system, right? So this is a good bond, good ground, uh, and any other telecommunications or any other wires. So this ground, right, the, it's a company procedure. They tell them that they got to clamp it to the meter box, but the builder did a better ground than this because when you clamp to this, you got to go through the paint, and so sometimes you don't get that good of a contact in your ground and it, all it takes is a little indirect lightning strike. You can see our satellite dish going up there. So it doesn't even have to be a full um, you know, hit of lightning. It can be a little ways away. Um, but if the builder is awesome enough to put those ground bar and termination systems in, let's utilize them. All right, Clayton Bailey, Green Scene Home Inspections, we're out.